It's great to be a Tomcat here at Tyler Elementary School. Hi, I'm Allison Satterwhite, School Board Representative for the Gainesville District. This school year is a very special one at Tyler because they're celebrating their 50th anniversary. Wow, a half century of educating students. Do you recognize any sight words here? Did you solve something? Very good. Tyler's home to the Spanish World Language programs has consistently been fully accredited and continues to shine academically. But Tyler isn't only an outstanding example of high academic achievement. Here, the school culture is one where they strive to meet the needs of the whole child, the social, physical, and emotional needs of each and every student. Jennifer Perella is the principal of Tyler, a supportive leader, and she shares how incorporating the practice of mindfulness is making a difference for students. Okay, if you get it right, you keep it. When you think about it, we spend a lot of our days upset about something that's already happened or worried about something that hasn't even happened, but actually very little time aware of the present moment. Uh, it's no secret that there's an increase in anxiety and depression. We wanted to offer our students something to help them learn to respond versus react throughout their day, and mindfulness has been that bridge for us. Or of your breath. I know for some of us that really focusing on the breath can feel really strained. So maybe it's just focusing on the body, feeling your Our feet goal on the was floor. to make it really easy for our staff to build it into their daily routines um, with students. So we've woven it into the fabric of our school. We start our staff meetings with the practice together. We have a school-wide commitment of five to ten minutes of daily practice in every classroom. That could be breathing, body scans, use of calming bottles, guided visualizations, yoga, gratitude journals. There are so many ways to help our students be more mindful. We renovated our bathrooms to reflect calm colors and positive messages. We have a mindful coloring poster in the hall when students first come, calm music, messaging on bulletin boards. Uh, we also offer a family mindfulness night for our families to learn and practice together. It's also important that we continue our own education. As a staff, we are reading Happy Teachers Change the World. We were blown away by our initial results. We saw a 50% reduction in the number of students being referred to the office. Additionally, the SOL results for our small group participants were remarkable. Many students ended up passing both their math and reading SOLs and overall showed large growth. Based on this, we felt it was important to share our journey with colleagues and encourage the division growth of mindfulness practices. More and more, our kids are impacted by social forces that can negatively affect their learning. Here at Tyler, as you can see, and across our school division, there are so many examples of how we're making strides addressing the whole child. The hiring of additional social workers, 13 this school year, and additional mental health specialists is something I push for as a school board member. These professionals are crucial to our mission of supporting the academic, social, emotional needs of all of our students. They are the link between home, school, and community and provide crisis intervention. We can't serve our students fully without these support professionals. Even what seems like a little thing can help our students. Flexible seating, for example. We're seeing more and more classrooms, including at Gravely Elementary School, with furniture options for students like couches, floor pillows, stools, bean bags, yoga balls. Research shows that there are benefits for student health and fitness when they have different options for sitting and even standing. And there are benefits for the brain, too. When students are in a comfortable environment, it helps students to be at their best and focus and learning are also increased. I'm just constantly impressed by our educators and support professionals here in Prince William County Schools. Through their dedication and efforts, we are increasingly able to address mental health needs in addition to the academic needs of our students. Congratulations on 50 great years, Tyler Elementary. There will be events celebrating this milestone in coming months, so alumni, staff, and families be on the lookout for announcements. My oldest daughter is a former Tomcat and was here for kindergarten through second grade. It really is a privilege to serve as a Gainesville District Representative on the school board. Thank you for partnering with us in the education of your students.